Yeah, I want to take example like hip arthroplasty yeah. or an example. Uh, you know, if you look into the design of hip arthroplasty, it is something that is related to a field in biomedical engineering which we refer to as biomaterials. Biomaterials. Yeah. The relationship between biomedical engineering and uh, physiotherapy is uh, number one, that uh, specialization that is there for biomedical engineering which is referred to as uh, biomechanics. I know uh, it is a course that is uh, uh, there in physiotherapy and uh, yeah, and then also there is a rehabilitation engineering uh, which is also uh, related to physiotherapy. In nutshell, uh, you know, uh, biomedical engineers, we manipulate biological uh, principles and as well as engineering principles to give a uh, solution to healthcare problems. So in terms of patients who are having a problem with uh, dislocation or people who have uh, uh, got their amputated. limbs amputated, amputated. So that is where biomedical engineering come into picture, where we utilize the engineering principle to develop like prosthetics, uh, you know, some artificial limbs for those patients. So this is where biomedical engineering comes into picture in relation to physiotherapy. And that's not only the main uh, relationship. The next one is when it comes to modalities. Yeah. You know, most of uh, phys uh, physiotherapy uh, treatments you see, they're mostly related to like applying heat, heat to, yeah, you know, therapy. to uh, so like heat therapy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. exactly. Tense, tense. Tense. Mm -hmm. those kind of, um, um. So uh, all these uh, modalities, now that's where biomedical engineering comes into picture again, because biomedical engineers are the ones who are uh, concerned with designing of this equipment uh, maintaining of this equipment and repair of this equipment if they go faulty. So there are lots uh, to talk about more in relation to uh, biomedical engineering and physiotherapy. So, so Ms. my question here is that are you guys biomedical engineers uh, in charge of making those arthroplasts like uh, yeah. artificial organs or what? Yeah, I want to take example like hip arthroplasty yeah. or an uh, example. Uh, you know, if you look into the design of hip arthroplasty, it is something that is related to a field in biomedical engineering which we refer to as biomaterials. Biomaterials. So uh, it's a field in now. Yeah, it is a field that does with manipulating any material mm. at, uh, you know, at adequate range mm. in which that material is utilized and then inserted into human mm. being to augment a medical procedure mm. or diagnosis or treatment. So this is why, and if you go into hip arthroplasty, if you look, you look at uh, the, uh, the, uh, the construction of hip arthroplasty, at the top we have some ceramic materials yeah, and we have yeah. some uh, aluminum, uh, uh, zirconia, mm -hmm. all these, uh, uh, all these uh, materials, they are biomaterials. So biomedical engineers also, uh, we, are in, we are concerned with uh, developing these biomaterials and also constructing of these uh, manipulating these biomaterials into constructing things like hip arthroplasty is also one of the job of biomedical engineers.